hello and welcome back to my channel single mom review if you would stop for one second look down below and click that subscribe word right next to that word is the little bell click on that bell make sure that it's completely shaded in so that you get notifications anytime I do any video uploads and please give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment down below I love getting to know my subscribers and conversing with you guys this evening again I'm jumping on to do a huge shout out to Johanna Masonette. I won the mystery bag giveaway and on her channel and she got this box of goodies in the mail right away to me and I'm gonna link her channel down below. Go down in the description box and click on that link and go over to her channel. She does all kinds of unboxings. She's very crafty on top of that and her videos she just has this bubbly personality and I get a kick and a joy out of watching her. So be sure you go down in the description box, click on her link and go over, and she's always doing giveaways. So make sure you go subscribe because you don't want to miss on, the, on her giveaways. And since we're talking about giveaways, this is what I received packed full from her. So let's unbox this and see what I got. And she, I mean like put ribbons around everything. She, she's so creative and crafty. First thing is a little card and single mom review hugs. She said, thank you. Single mom review, congratulations, you won my mystery bag giveaway. Thank you for your support and being part of my YouTube channel. Be safe, Johanna, 2021. And don't we need in 2021 some little highlights like this to brighten our day? Yes, we do. Oh, how pretty. Let's get it out of this bag. It is a rhinestone necklace and earrings. Fashion jewelry. Isn't that pretty? Let me try it on for you guys. You know how I am about jewelry. Oh, that is so pretty. And the rhinestone diamond stud earrings are just gorgeous to match it. Oh, beautiful. Already starting out amazing. Next little baggie, she has baggied up two items. Let's get this out. The first thing is Kinsey Life Beat Body Lotion. Directions are to apply to dry skin. Apply the lotion before going to bed. Use this lotion on a daily basis to get the most benefit from it. And I can use two kinds of tubes of hand cream, body lotion. Has a little. I keep them at my desk at school. I keep them in my purse. I keep them by my bed. It's almost like I can't have enough hand cream and body lotion. Oh, it didn't say anything about a scent, but it has a nice little scent there. I like that. I'm gonna get my hands good and lotioned for the evening, so I'm gonna get a little bit more. Maybe Life Beat was the scent. Well, Life Beat smells good. It's not overpowering, but it's just a little. Uh, I like that. All right, next item in the little baggie here. This is Manica Dar Beauty Simplified Lip Locked Priming Lipstick in the color Love. Ooh, that's pretty. Isn't that a pretty color? How pretty. Manica Dar is usually a pretty good brand too, so great item there. All right, another little goodie bag. Next item is Hello Fab, and Fab stands for First Aid Beauty. Pores Be Gone Matte Primer with Fig Extract, Oil Free, Safe for Sensitive Skin. And apply evenly over clean face. 
I love a good primer. I use a primer underneath my makeup every day. So this will get used most definitely. Next item in the little baggie is another Fab Pharma First Aid Beauty Arnica Relief and Rescue Mask Soothe and De-Stress. Apply to clean, dry skin, allow to absorb and tissue off any excess. Okay. This will be something else I try. I love trying different masks. Love that. And the last item in this little baggie is Hey Honey 24 7 Honey Day and Night Moisturizing Cream. Enriches and revitalizes face, neck, and eye area, and it's for all skin types. Rich anti-aging day and night moisturizer for face, neck, and eye area. Vitamins A and C, antioxidants, and peptides combine to boost cell renewal, keeping skin feeling young, moisturized, and radiant. On clean skin, gently massage until absorbed. Use morning and night. I can't wait to give this a try. I love a good moisturizer in the morning and at night. So another great product. She has set me up with some great products. Uh, okay, she knows the way to my heart here because a baggie of chocolate. Johanna, you're the sweetest. Two Kit Kats, two Hershey Kisses, and two Hershey Milk Chocolates with almonds. Milk chocolate with almond is my favorite. So, oh my gosh, it's nighttime and I shouldn't be having these, but I'm gonna have a snack here in a little while. Just telling you. And I've had all those that's in that baggie and they're all good. I loved the February Ipsy bags. Loved, loved, loved them. This is adorable. Love yourself. And of course, it was the, an actual mystery bag sent from Ipsy filled with all the mystery bag items. And Ipsy's mystery bags were top-notch items inside, I think. I didn't get one, but everybody I saw unbagged them, they were top-notch. First item, Oprah. I love Oprah products. And, they, and Oprah highlighters are bar none some of the best. Um, this is the Oprah highlighter Blissful. I mean, they, I can't say enough good things about Oprah highlighters. I, I seriously can't. They are beautiful on. They go on so nicely and they just look absolutely beautiful. Next item out of this mystery bag is the Tarte High Performance Naturals Park Avenue Princess is the color, Amazonian Clay Waterproof Bronzer. Tarte is another top-notch brand. You can't go wrong with Tarte products. And you know, bronzers, it's almost sometimes better to have a little smaller one. My, my skin tone changes so much. I'm Native American, so any type of sun changes my skin tone immediately. A smaller bronzer is almost better for me. So Park Avenue Princess. And that is the color, that's a beautiful color. It's not too dark, but it's not too light. I really like that color. And that I did that when I got the little piece of plastic off. Next item is the Musha Boom Pressed Eyeshadow by Phase Zero Makeup. Let's see what it is. This is the Mush A Boom Pressed Eyeshadow. Let's open it. Oh, that's pretty, and that is definitely like a mushroom color. They didn't miss that. Beautiful. It's like a silver. That is very pretty. I like that, but it's a dark silver. It's a, almost like a dark gray silver. Very pretty. Let's just see what that looks like on. Next item. And this is by the Balm Cosmetics Wheel Powder Blush Perseverance Clean Beauty and Green Packaging. Let's open this up. Slides out. And then it pops open. Has a little magnetic pop open. Oh, wow, that's a beautiful color. I've used a Balm Cosmetics, I think it's called Girl Power or Girl Powder. 
blush highlighter palette and blush was very deep pigmented and I loved it. Wheel powder, I clean up nicely and so can you. Please recycle this packaging. Clean beauty and green packaging. So they're very, sounds like environmental friendly. And the last thing that was in the mystery bag is here. The Farah 35E brush. Isn't that pretty? Oh, that is so soft. I mean, it is soft, soft. And I have not been into makeup long enough to really have an abundance of brushes. But when I get different ones like this, and I'm just like, oh yeah, that one's going away, and this one's coming in the lineup. <laughs> Johanna, thank you so much. Everything I got was absolutely amazing. So let's recap and see what all I got. The, the giveaway that I won was for this Ipsy mystery bag love yourself with the five items that came in it which was the Farah brush here the Oprah highlighter the Tarte Park Avenue Princess Amazonian clay waterproof bronzer the Mesha Boom pressed eyeshadow from phase zero and the Balm Cosmetics Wheel Powder and the color Perseverance. Those were the five products that came in the mystery bag. That was the giveaway that I won. Now, she took it upon herself and added some extra goodies in here, and I can't thank her enough. My extra goodies were this heart rhinestone silver necklace the rhinestone stud earrings to match, the Manica Dar Beauty Simplified Lip Locked Priming Lipstick in the color Love, the Kinsey Life Beat Body Lotion that smells wonderful, the Hello Fab First Aid Beauty Pores Be Gone Matte Primer, the Fab Pharma First Aid Beauty Arnica Relief and Rescue Mask. And the Hey Honey 24-7 Honey Day and Night Moisturizing Cream. I love everything. Thank you so much, Johanna. I can't thank you enough. Please go down and click on her link in my description box. Go over to her channel, watch some of her videos. I have one more item I want to share with you guys before I get off. I have a friend mail and it says here do not open until March 17th so I didn't I put it off to the side when I went to film tonight I was like oh yeah I gotta get this out this is from the most amazing Stephanie from opinionated horsewoman she's on top of her game let's open this up and see what it is all right St. Patrick's Day card on St. Patrick's Day. She's the best at cards. Oh, of course she has stickered the inside up. She's a sticker girl, just like me. When I send packages out, I have stickers all over the outside of the package. Sherry, hope your day is bright with happiness, warm with love, and full of special moments to enjoy. I hope your day was wonderful. Love you, girl. Stephanie, opinionated horsewoman. She just makes my day. She is always thinking of making others smile. Wow, it's hard to find those kinds of people in the world today. She sent a little sticker here. It says, do what makes you happy. And you know what, it took me a lot of years in life to figure that out, but I, I finally did. And she sent me a cottage garden wildflower mix. American seed, finest quality since 1897. Our seeds are always 100% non-GMO. This pleasing mixture of the most popular annual and perennial wildflowers captures the casual charm of an English cottage garden. Plants bloom throughout the season in a variety of colors, shapes, and heights for a striking, coordinated look. Reblooms year after year. I love things that rebloom. Days to germinate are 7 to 21. Depth to sow is 1 8 inch. Their growing height is 1 to 3 feet. Sow seeds outdoors in early spring in a sunny location with well-drained soil after 
danger of frost is passed. Roughen soil surface to a depth of one to three inches. Remove any weeds. Distribute seed evenly over the planting area. Rake seed in lightly. Keep soil consistently moist for four to six weeks. The cottage garden mix contains annual baby's breath, black-eyed Susan, blue flax, calendula, California poppy, coropsis, plains, cornflower, corn poppy, cosmos, foxglove, larkspur, lupin, pheasant's eye, purple coneflower, shasta daisy, sweet william, and wallflower. Garden hints. Each fall cut the plants back to two to three inches above the soil to allow plants to reseed themselves the following season. Note, some of perennials do not reach full maturity until the second season. I didn't know that. Outdoor planting dates. I am very close to zone two and zone three. Zone two is March through June and zone three is April through June. So I would just plant in April just to be on the safe side. So can't wait to find me a little spot outside and get these planted. Thank you, Stephanie. Always thinking of others, you're a doll. And I'm going to link Stephanie's channel down below. Go down, click on her link. She's very knowledgeable about skincare. She does lots of unboxings, lots of mystery bags. So go down, click on her link, and go over to her channel and check out a few of her videos. You guys have a most wonderful evening, and I will be talking to you again real soon. Bye!